After three months of traveling around the country, tonight is the last show of the tour. It was a really big night for me. Um, I've been on the road doing this college tour since January, and tonight is the, uh, the last night of the tour. Also, uh, I grew up in Ames, so I... I uh, as, a, as a kid, I would come see the shows here at Visha, and it's, it's really fun being back here on the other side of it. Um, a lot of friends and family in the audience tonight, so thank you very much for coming. I hope you have a good night. I wish you all the best. Take care, everybody. Thank you. Now, I have to tell you about what's coming next because normally when I'm done with a tour, I come back and work here from the studio for a few months to invent new magic and come up with new pieces for the next tour. The problem is that this doesn't make for very interesting weekly episodes. So, starting next week, I'm gonna show you something I've been saving for a few years. Uh, the, the story behind this footage is extraordinarily long and complicated, but, but let me just say that it is one of the greatest adventures I've ever had. Uh, and I can't, I can't wait to show it to you. Up next, I left to search for magic and search for other magicians in different cultures. Going by train or bus or rickshaw or hitchhiking in the back of someone's truck. Looking for shaman or witch doctors or street performers or anyone who can help me see magic in a different way. Jesus, this is the strangest day of my entire life. Can I just say that right now?